Now, fruit exporters say that they will be taking action against Transnet as the logistics crisis drags on. Hortgrow, the fruit producer organization, says exporters are likely to lose billions because of the delays and congestion at the Cape Town port, and Transnet needs to be held accountable. The trouble comes as the industry faces bumper harvests. It's difficult to quantify the loss at this stage. Uh, we're just entering our peak season, uh, but we are looking at a vessel by vessel uh, sort of a, a quantification, which we will be able to do in the next two to three weeks. Uh, but last year and the year before that, because this, this is the fourth year that we are struggling uh, and Transnet not sticking to their undertakings, uh, the loss was... Uh, around two and a half billion rand uh, per annum the last the last two seasons at least uh, so you can just imagine what the impact of of of, of that is uh, on the income of, of of our growers because it comes all, all comes off the proverbial bottom line so uh, we have seen some some uh, Im improvements some management changes the last week and uh, and we are heartened by the commitment shown by the by the new uh, uh, management and 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 operational staff but I'm afraid it's uh, a little bit uh, too little too late. So, uh, yeah, we are con uh, looking at some, some legal recourse uh, on a vessel-by-vessel -vessel basis, definitely, uh, because it's fairly easy to quantify. Uh, but even on a broader industry level, we are looking at uh, possible class action. It's uh, more complex. Uh, it will be more time, uh, sort of a timely or long-term uh, type of uh, of intervention, but we have no choice but to look at some re uh, remedies uh, which the legal uh, route can bring us.